Hey, this is Perdic Wes. I am going to talk about the iPhone SE 4. We do not know. Either way, this is what I feel the iPhone SE 4 should be. A body of iPhone 13 or 15 respectively. Either way, whichever Apple decides to go. You might be asking why the 15. I feel the finish on the 15 looks way more premium and the matte finish are really good. Secondly, as for the color waves, Apple would go either for three colors that is black, white or product red, hopefully product red because that's been staple on almost all the iPhone SE models whatever we have so far. As for the display, we would we might see OLED display no doubt on it but here's what I would I would say. You will not see the dynamic island considering it has become a staple on the 15 but Apple would not give dynamic island to the SE so soon. The notch would be there but I would consider the notch to be from the 13 because the 15, uh, the 14 notch is okay. Okay, As for, there would be a notch on the iPhone SE which is fine with me. Dynamic island is something I f still feel is great to have but I would say it's like a 50-50. I, personally for me it would be a 50-50 not sure about I'm not sure about how you all feel about the dynamic island. Let me know in the comment section below. Coming to battery life, I feel this is some something which I feel Apple should really focus on, especially on the iPhone SE. If Apple can give the battery life 50% of the 13 or the 15 respectively, when I say 50%, I mean half of what the battery capacities are. That way, it would not only be a good battery life, the best, ba uh, what do you say, value for money in terms of battery, but overall experience as well. Since that's where the previous iPhone SE models have been lacking, in my opinion, especially in the battery side. Software, cameras have always been decent enough. Coming to the cameras, I feel we would see a 48 megapixel camera. This is what I feel personally. Even 12 megapixels should be fine, at least. I do have most part, but I feel 48 megapixels would be the default. Here's a co interesting thing which I feel Apple could possibly do, and I feel might happen. I feel Apple should give a iPhone SE a single lens camera, considering this is mostly focused on people on average consumers and people who do not want to spend mo more on iPhones, more money on iPhones. So giving a 48 megapixel default camera is good and maybe a 12 megapixel front facing camera the display would, might, would most probably see an OLED display hopefully a, a better one and here's something interesting I would personally feel I think might not happen but there is a slight chance we would see and that 2000 nits brightness the one we currently have on the iPhone 15. Personally, I feel this is not a deal breaker, but it would be nice to have. As for the color options, we could possibly see only three color waves. That is black, white and product red, hopefully, since we have seen product red in previous iPhone SE models. And we will probably see USB-C. Now, here's something it's still, it's still not finalized or uh, we don't know if this is really going to happen or no personally I feel might happen it depends on because Apple being Apple we cannot predict what they might do next with the iPhone SE they could either go the iPhone 13 way or the iPhone 15 way but I know Apple will not go for the 15 because currently that's the model more popular than the, even the pros this year so my thing is yeah so as i was saying we would see we might see an action button on the sc and here's something what i feel apple might do and might not do might do considering just to entice the customers to buy the sc considering it's almost as good as the regular 15 models but here's what I feel Apple should bring back is the mute switch on the iPhone SE 4. 
because that's not been seen in the previous mod at, the, at least in the current models so hopefully we see a muted back hopefully we see a muted back on the iphone se because if that happened that would be a really nice bonus in my opinion and coming to se we will see usb c no doubt do let me know what do let me know what you wish to see on the iphone se 4 yeah as always i forget one thing and that's apple pricing currently the apple pricing of the iphone se is under 400 bucks which is decent enough as long as iphone se price is not increased then i feel it would be a better buy only for three main reason in my opinion usb c default 48 megapixel camera and a great battery life if these three apple marks makes it good if these three things happen i feel it would be a best buy over even the regular 15 and yes culture drink we do not we might not have a dynamic island okay this is something i am not sure as for the speakers on the iphone se upcoming iphone se i feel they would be decent enough because apple has always nailed the speakers no matter what they are good at speakers cameras and now displays so whatever it is and yeah mainly now coming to the design aspect i said apple will most probably go for a single lens camera because that's what i feel they will do it as for the layout i feel a vertical layout will much better than compared to a dynamic uh diagonal layout currently what we see on the iphone 13 and 14 respectively if apple could do a fashion version of iphone 10 or the 6s or maybe 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 just give the iphone a combined version of 13 and 15 Frankenstein version that would be solid. I, you know why? Because this is where a battery of iPhone 13 and a design of 15, if it merges, it would, if it combines, it would be solid iPhone, no matter what. As long as battery life is good enough. Till then, this is your poetic wish. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Live your dreams. Mm -hmm.